All right, as you guys may have heard, nutrition is the X factor when it comes to getting results. So today I want to introduce you guys to my good friend here, Rodney over in Houston, Texas. Rodney owns Wholesale Nutrition. I want to give you guys a tour of the studio. Here's Rodney. Rodney, say hello to What's everyone. What's up, guys? Tell us a little about yourself, Rodney. So um, my name is Rodney Fisher. I've been in this industry for the last 25 years, ex-competitive bodybuilder for about 17 of those years. Um, started working in this industry in the mid-90s up until now. Huge change in the industry. A lot going on today. Lots of products available today. Here at Wholesale Nutrition, we have almost 5,000 square foot of anything and everything you could think of supplement related. Um, as well as a lot of information, whether you're just trying to trim down for the summer or get ready for a show, we have what you need here. All right, thank you, Rodney. Can you give us a tour of everything? Sure. As you can see, we have pretty much any fat burning product you can think of, as well as pre-workout product that you can think of, nitric oxide for your pumps in the gym, Walls and walls and walls of proteins, different blends of proteins, you know, fast acting, uh, you know, blends of proteins as well as fast acting. We have all your vitamins, herbs, minerals as well, if that's what you need. We have all that covered. So for those who may not be aware of it, when you say fast acting, how can that, what are the benefits of that? How can that help someone? So typically people take a, like a, for example, a whey protein for post training because whey protein enters the bloodstream fast. The downfall is it also leaves the bloodstream fast. So if you're using it for a post-training setting, it's great. If you're not using it for that, I would recommend a blend, something with a whey in it, but also an egg and a casein. So you have the medium and the slow releasing proteins as well. Just more versatile this so way. So you're telling the mom or dad, or even the kid at home who's looking to pound on some serious muscle, that they shouldn't just sit around chugging whey protein shakes just for the sake Absolutely of chugging. Absolutely not, yeah, it has to be, it has to fit the setting. Post-workout. That's right. You guys hear it here. See, my guy Rodney already giving you guys a few gems. <laughs> If you're, if you're one that needs something quick and on the go, if you want something high protein and, and low carb and low sugar and things like that for your diet purposes, you got plenty of selection of bars to choose from as well. And for, the, for today's person that's on the go 24 seven, it's definitely something that most people utilize today. Nice. We also have a, a selection of, you know, ready to drink stuff. If that's, again, if you need something convenience oriented, we have all the ready to drink type stuff as well. You know, whether it's proteins or energy and fat burning drinks as well, which we have on the other side here. We pretty much have anything that you can think of for all your drink purposes as well. So whatever it is, we got it. <laughs> Last thing I'll show you is the weight gain section. If you're a skinny kid needs to put on some pounds, this is the section for you, you back You got here. an entire section for those guys, huh? There's nothing but just, you know, all your weight gaining uh, stuff back here. So, excuse the uh, construction, do a, little, do a little construction back here, but expanding with all of our stuff back here at the moment. So please excuse it. So for anyone looking to pack on some muscle. Absolutely. Rodney has a section for you. That's right. <laughs> Uh, pretty much other than that, I mean, like I said, anything that you can think of supplement related, we have, you know, there's just, it's almost uh, endless what I could go on about, whether it be vitamins, minerals, you know, amino acids, pump products, pre-workouts, you name it, we have it. Okay, so while we have you here, can you, we're going to ask you a couple of questions. Sure. Maybe no particular category, but what are your four, three to four favorite products here? Definitely a good protein source because I feel like that's the most underutilized thing that people have okay. in, in terms of like getting the response that they want right. from the gym. You know, you see people going to the gym for hours at a time but not really ever change. Right. And that's generally speaking because the diet's just not there. The protein intake's not what it should be. They're not eating enough frequency in their meals as well. So I would have to say the protein's gonna be first and foremost on my list right. in terms of what's, you know, um, most utilized. So with proteins, again, I like blends like we talked about a while ago. So. I like a product called Protozyme, which is made by Metabolic Nutrition. So I'm gonna actually show you guys the product. I like the Protozyme because again, the Protozyme's a blend. It's got the whey, the egg, and the muscle or casein. So it's good for any time of the day, whether it's just meal replacement, post-training, before bed, anytime. Because it's high protein and low carbs too. 
There we go. So, and for those who may not, you know, you and I understand the casein, but let's talk about the difference between whey and casein for those who may not know. So, whey protein is, like I said earlier, the whey protein is what people typically use for post-training setting because it enters the bloodstream fast, but like I said, it also it leaves the bloodstream fast. And being our bodies can't store it, we need something more sustained release. So you have the fast from the whey, you have the egg white that's in the uh, protein as well, which is your more medium release. And then you have what's following up the egg white is you have the micellar casein. Micellar casein is a, is a really slowly broken down protein source that's good for hours instead of just, you know, 60 to 90 minutes like whey protein itself. So then you have the fast, the medium and the slow release. So again, it's good for any time of the day, whether it's post training setting, before bed, meal replacement there's no bad time for this protein because it's also high protein and low carb so you don't have to worry about loading up on carbohydrates and getting fat so right. you can actually add carbs to it if you want but it's also starting at low carb which is better for most people yeah. and here's the product that he mentioned again the three-in-one blend they have various flavors here at wholesale we have the banana cream the butter pecan cookie we have the vanilla cream we have the strawberry we have the peanut butter have the chocolate chip and then maybe some additional flavors that he has in the back because he only keeps so much stuff out front second uh, second item i would think would be again it varies by person but right. i like the convenience factor of things just because everybody's on the go so much so i do like the bars um, a lot just because they're easily to supplement into the diet most bars have about 20 grams of protein which is equivalent to about right around six egg whites worth nice. of protein so it's a quick, easy way that actually tastes good as well of getting your protein intake in. So what's your flavor? I would have to say the almond. Ah, we got, we, you guys seen that smile. We found the spot. There we go. <laughs> this is going to be one of my favorites. It's like an almond joy. It's basically like an almond joy. 20 grams of protein, almond joy. Low sugar, virt virtually no sugar. Only about four to five net carbs with 20 grams of protein. Phenomenal tasting. Very good. If you like an almond joy, you'd love it. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Uh, I would say the next product that I'd probably recommend the most would be the Myovite vitamins. I love a good multivitamin, but I don't like just a, a standard basic multivitamin. This thing encompasses every aspect of, of health and digestion and amino acids and everything you could think of. Not only that, but there's 44 individual packs. So you take one ind an individual pack with a meal, of course. But if you look at the ingredients, you'll see why I like it so much. This thing is loaded with you know, all the high dose multivitamins and minerals. It's got more of the vitamins and minerals than anything I've ever seen, as well as the best forms of those, as well as digestive enzymes, amino acids, you know, stuff for anti-inflammatory. I mean, you, you have it all with this product. And it's a one pack a day type of a product. So it's a 44 day supply oh, per box. And, and just touching on something you spoke about, conversation you and I have had uh, off the record, but so often we see products and we may see you know, you have excellent, the best of the best products here. But let's talk about how there's, you know, some people just don't know what they don't know. So sometimes they sure. may see your product here and try to get the equivalent of that at a Walgreens, a CVS, a Walmart. So how can we get them to understand that those two products, although the name may be the same, the dosage and the overall quality of the product can vary? Well, typically what you see with variants in that regard would be the proteins. The proteins are which, which you can find at Sam's Club, Costco, Walmart, even though, like, let's just take whey protein, for example, you'll see a whey protein that seems like it's a really, really great deal, but the problem is there's a lot of variance with whey proteins. You can go all the way down to WPC-40, which is 40%, all the way up to WPC-80, which is 80%. Typically, what, they, what they're going to use is on the lower end of the spectrum. That's why if you've ever talked to somebody that got a, a protein from Walmart or, or Walgreens or wherever, and they always complain about stomach upset and bloating and things like that that they never really got before, it's because they're buying, these guys are buying such vast quantities at such a cheap price point that they have to get the bottom of the barrel protein right we only sell the stuff that's a, that's more the pure stuff they got their stuff we have our stuff our stuff's a lot a lot more pure it might be a few bucks more than what you could get from a walgreens or a, or a costco or wherever but it's much more quality you don't get all the stomach irritations and things like that so we there's not apples to apples with a lot of the products especially proteins so it's safe to say that the the model remains you get what you pay for that's right all right, that's 100%. what I'm talking about. So before we let you go, uh, what advice, insight, or tips do you have for anybody who's watching along? You know that everybody's fitness journey is different. Their starting points are different alongside of their goals. So what insight or knowledge can you leave these guys with before we head out? 
biggest aspect of anything, whether you're trying to get lean, whether you're trying to get bigger, whether you're trying to get stronger, the biggest insight and, and, and tip I could give you is to watch your diet. Make sure you're eating small, frequent meals throughout the day with plenty of protein intake in it. That is the biggest thing I could tell people, and that's the number one thing that I always talk to people and they're, and they're missing. Because again, just like I spoke on earlier, they train like animals in the gym. But when outside the gym, they just don't eat what they're supposed to eat to make the necessary uh, you know, achievements that they're wanting to make outside of the gym. So diet is foremost the biggest thing that I could say that people need to do is small frequent meals, get the protein intake up in the diet to make all the changes they want in their body. Nice. So, again, you told us a lot about you. Thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule. There are about 15 people behind us, Craig, <laughs> trying to get your attention, so we do appreciate it. Uh, tell us you know, your address, uh, your, your website online, any social media. How can the audience come by and grab some great products and you know have a, another discussion with you and learn more about the different Absolutely. things you're doing here? We're located on, at 5747 Richmond Avenue, which is directly across the street from the Sam's Boat. So if you find Sam's Boat, just look, look across the street, you find us. Our hours are Monday through Saturday, 10 to 7, Sunday, 12 to 5, so we're open seven days a week. Um, I'm here Mondays and Wednesdays, Linda's here the rest. Between the both of us, we have over 50 years of being in this industry. So any questions that you have, I promise you we can answer those. Nice. You guys have a website online or a social media? Uh, yep. Social media is, is Wholesale Nutrition, um, and our uh, website is HoustonSupplements.com. Nice. So you guys... You heard it here first from the pro, from the expert himself. Thank you again for your time, Rodney. Absolutely. Everybody who's watching, make sure you shop and get you some great products. Diet is key. That's it. See you guys. See you.